Hello and welcome back to my Dentistry in Australia series. If you missed my previous video, I am Dr. Abir Khazi and I am here to talk about the ADC exam and how to license yourself as a dentist in Australia. Initially, we talked about the self-assessment process needed and the part one and part two exams in Australia briefly. Now I'm going to talk about the part one exam and how to book it. After you have been approved by the ADC for your initial assessment, you will receive a letter saying that you are eligible to apply for the written exam. The written exam application opens about four months before the written exam actually takes place. Once the application is open, after six weeks of uh, applying for the exam, you will receive a notification from ADC that you have to register yourself to with Pearson View. Pearson View is a partnership with ADC who conduct the exam. They do not mark the exam, they are just conducting the exam. There are various centers of Pearson View around the world. Unfortunately, a center does not exist in Pakistan for Part 1 ADC exam. The closest location to give Part 1 ADC exam is Dubai. The Part 1 exam also takes place in India and in various countries of the Gulf. You can check all of this information once you register yourself with the Pearson View website. They will ask you to make an email address and to make a password to log yourself in. Once they approve your account, you will be able to register yourself with the ADC exam. Sometimes the online website does not work and you have to book the exam by phone in the center you wish to take the exam. You have to be very, very vigilant in booking the exam because the places are taken up very quickly. I had chosen five centers in Dubai where I wanted to book my exam and by the time I called, four out of five centers had already been filled up. So you have to be very vigilant wherever you choose to book your exam. And you have to make sure that when you book your exam, you book your day one and your day two in the same center. That is very important. If you book it in a different center, you will not be able to give the exam. After you have booked your exam, Pearson we will send you a confirmation email about your examination date. They will also tell you what requirements are needed of you. Usually a photograph identity and an another identity are needed which you have to take with you to Pearson View in that specific chosen country. Without that, you cannot give the exam. I hope that this video has helped you in the process of booking the exam. I had no one to guide me and I am here to help you. Please stay tuned for more videos. Thank you.